Yo, what's up, guys? It's the Mobile Vision Gamer here, and I'm going to be talking about the NFL Bosses promo in this video and just sort of going over the sets if you're confused on anything and how to make your coins with this promo. So, of course, they've added these insane NFL Bosses plus five boosts and for a kick returner and a uh, Hester and a, a position of QB. That's pretty sick. Now, uh, of course, you most likely have spent the time to sort of look through all of these for the one part i think one of the best um sets that a lot of people don't know about is this token exchange now i think a lot of people are just really confused by it like why would you trade in one token for one token but if you click the little eye you can get one or more boss tokens so basically you could you could get one boss token and if you just play your uh, cards right you could just keep doing the set of course there's a day cooldown which kind of sucks but you could keep doing the set until you pull 10 like you could get two turn two into three three into five etc etc and you could eventually just get 10 which i think is kind of op but that's the same token there's a low chance you pull more than one and it does take a day cooldown so that kind of sucks another thing um if you're gonna <coughs> If you're gonna try to do the um like these little uh sets uh i would recommend staying away from the higher overall ones because you don't really make your money on those uh especially like 99 maybe the 99 overall one overall one if you have 400k just sitting around um i would recommend the collectibles i don't know that's just me because i have a bunch of collectibles and especially the gold collectible if you've been doing fan favorite you've been uh putting in the time you will um like you will have pretty much enough to get a free boss token right there um i will for me personally when do the trophies these item upgrades i'm not sure if i really like them that much but again it's all up to opinion so anyways let's get right on into the coin making guide all right so my first filter is pretty much the basic one it is just elite 10,000, and you can kind of mess around with the price but any player that drops here you're gonna make pretty much uh 3k on it which doesn't seem like a lot but if you get some decent drops like a 90 overall drops or maybe uh, an elite trophy those will sell for so much well even 15k so you could oh those are my uh sold items but even 15k you can sell them and they'll quick sell uh maybe 17500 yeah 17500 looks like that's the cap so looks like everything will sell for 15k so if you get a decent drop on the 10k uh, such as like a 90 overall it's gonna sell for much more and i know this is a basic filter and a lot of people are gonna be on it but for those who have little coins this is a good filter all right so here's the next filter it's just 90 overall pluses for less than 25k uh excludes seahawks and Steelers. as you can see i mean you're not gonna get the most profit out of these maybe two three k max but again if you get a good drop like i've gotten of course the 91 tyree killer drop uh, I don't know if you saw that, but I made, like, a, a bunch of profit. Of course, like, you're not really in it for the specific players to drop. You're more or less in it. Ooh, wow. Yeah, that round just dropped. See, like, Nick Fairley might have gone for a bunch. Uh, ooh, that was a decent round. I guess that Aaron Donald's not. Aaron Donald's not bad. Uh, if you want, you can take out DN. I actually would recommend doing that because that, get, that gets rid of a lot of, like, horrible players. But there you go. So... Uh, if you get a decent drop, you can make serious bank. But of course, all 90 overall, uh, 91 overall pluses. Uh, yeah, you definitely might want to change it to 91 because again, that's the separate set. Uh, the 91 overall uh, pluses. Uh, I don't know if that makes sense, but anyways, on to the next filter. All right, so I kind of just want to talk about this is not a sniping filter, but I kind of just want to enforce for those of you who really don't believe in investing. So for example. This Marcus Peters, he was the other day 350k, easy. And look at this, he's going for like 600k now. That would have been insane profit if you bought like 10 of them. Of course, I didn't invest in them because I didn't know about this whole NFL boss promo until yesterday. But that's some insane profit right there. And I mean, you just gotta. I recommend following the big YouTubers and just keeping up with the news because you never know. This crazy stuff like this might drop, like this promo and you could have made serious bank invest. And finally, we're back to the basic filter, which is just gold for 1999. Of course, again, everybody's on this filter, but as you can see from my auctions, every gold player, no matter what, goes for 3K. Like, look, 
So if you buy them all for like 2k or something, you're uh, and you buy like 10 of them around, that's a pretty decent profit, not gonna lie. Of course, it's a little bit of a grind, but that just kind of gives you some ideas of how to use this promo to your advantage. I know all these ideas are pretty basic and you probably figured these out, but again, I'm just trying to get the ball rolling. Maybe I'll come up with a better filter, but I really just like, like this boss promo. I just really wish that they sort of made different levels so that way all players of the game could get some insane players and not just like the top tier grinders. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, go down below, go subscribe, go comment, and I'll see you all next video.